Hey, what's up guys? It's Corey Gregory, co-founder of Muscle Farm. I was up in the Pittsburgh area to come see my buddy Jim Mannion. Got my MPC gear on today. And I wanted to go over a couple uh, movements that I kind of stole from powerlifting, but I've kept into my uh, routine even with bodybuilding. So two moves that I got whenever I was uh, at the Westside Barbell when I was doing a powerlifting stint. Uh, one's for power in the triceps, and the other one just to get a bunch of blood in the triceps as a finisher. So we'll start out here first with the uh, dumbbell rollback, which is essentially like a skull crusher, but there's a little bit different unique um, kind of technique to it for when you're doing it for power from uh, the powerlifting guy. So a lot of times we do set it up on the ground, and you want to keep the dumbbells tucked into your front delts. Elbows nice and high, and when you, when you push them off the ground, your, your elbows will cave a little bit and then press straight through. Now when you come back in, you tuck it back in your front delt, roll it back. You want the dumbbell to hit the floor, both parts of the dumbbell each time, and then come straight through, just like so. And so it's a good kind of explosive movement. But you'll notice though, it'll really add some good thickness to your triceps. And also, I mean, at one point I was, when I was lifting real super heavy, you can go 80, 100 pound dumbbells like this. I've seen some guys do some pretty crazy, crazy weight up the west side. But even if you're doing reps of 15 or 20, it just hits the tricep in a different angle. And so you can just float through, get a good rhythm. The big thing is, is don't hit yourself in the face because that can happen real quick if you just get a little bit, uh, I messed up my kangle there. You get a little bit crazy with the form. So just like so. So that's the first one. The second one is just a straight um, band push down. Now, whenever uh, I was first introduced to bands when I went to uh, Westside, I was thinking of like tubing bands, meaning like this kind of band right here. Now, when you see this, this is like a rehab band, which I was like, what the hell is this gonna do for me, right? Now, they introduced me into the jump stretch bands, which I've been using for several years now. We squatted against them, uh, deadlifted against them. But what, one of the things I've always used since then is high rep tricep just blowouts. And so really just grabbing that attention, just like a, a regular push down where it feels good, and just repping it from chest height and down. And although it looks like not much anything, everything they do there on this would be 30 to 50 reps. And I'm gonna tell you what, high reps, low reps, this thing will put some serious blood into your triceps. And what, the way they use them is because they're locking out big weight with a lot of the bench shirts, it helped all the connective tissue around the tricep, around your elbow, and so you can kind of stay injury free. What I like about it is if I'm supersetting stuff, a lot of times I'll do a normal bodybuilding exercise for triceps and then a rep right into 30 reps like this and it puts some crazy blood in your triceps. So I would definitely hit up uh, jumpstretch.com or we have them at uh, joinarealgym.com. We sell the bands and just throw it in your, your bag and take it to your gym with you. And there's so many different applications that you can use with these style bands. Uh, the mini bands or it would be the next step up which is the uh, medium bands I believe. So I would definitely add this into your training, 30 rep, high rep sets, you can do regular, you can go over, head this way too, and so you can keep it, um, keep it kind of changed up and really a superset you could run is the dumbbells on the floor, dumbbell rollbacks right into 30 down, 30 over the head, throw some serious blood in your triceps. Hopefully uh, you can check that out and uh, there'll be more from me here soon. Thanks. And don't forget mpcnewsonline.com for more information. <laughs>